So our Challenger Center uh, here in Hazard opened in 1999. So we've just celebrated our 20th anniversary. Uh, during those 20 years, we've served well over 150,000 students that have participated in some area of our programming. Um, in addition to the simulated space missions that we do, we also have a program called Mars Invasion 2030 from the Cold Camp Space Camp, where we compare coal mining to space science. Uh, we do outreach into schools. We host a first Lego League robotics competition. Um, plus, we have a, a, a large array of summer programs that we do for students of all ages talk about how we've used the Kentucky Colonel's funds to start some new um, AV programs that are going to incorporate some of the latest technology and trends into the education of our young students. So many of our students live their lives involved in YouTube, multimedia streaming, Snapchat, things of that nature. So we feel it's really important to engage students with things they're familiar with. We want students to understand that these things can lead to marketable careers. There are huge amounts of opportunity, whether it's Hollywood movie making or just social media marketing for companies. So we want students to develop these practical skills to apply them to career pathways and to get some understanding that they can produce things. John Goodall is one of our better known natives here in Hazard, Kentucky. He is actually a Kentucky Colonel and was the lead engineer for the Viking Lander Project, one of the first landers to land on the surface of Mars. We're very proud to have him as a Kentucky native and a Kentucky Colonel, a shining example of education in our region and what we can accomplish. And we really appreciate the opportunities provided by the Kentucky Colonels. We wouldn't be able to provide such high quality programs without their support.